DMAKE or DMAIC is an acronym for the improvement methodology of Six Sigma. It stands for Define, Measure, Analyze, Improve and Control. It is very simple and a methodology that is used throughout Six Sigma projects in real life following these five steps. We'll go into much more detail and provide a step-by-step -step guide within the green or black belt training, but for now I'll just provide an overview. Define refers to defining the problem in a problem statement. What is the problem, how often does it occur, and what is the impact? In this phase, you need to outline who the project leader is and create a project charter that outlines the scope of the project. Finally, you need to select an appropriate team who have the knowledge of the process you are looking to improve. They understand the nature of the problem and they can help you throughout this DMAIC process. Next, we move on to measure. Measure is all about understanding the current state of the problem. It is all about data helping us understand the magnitude of the problem. Data should be collected not just around the process, but also measuring what the customers care about, and that may be lead time or quality improvements. As always, data should be questioned and analysed to check whether it is reliable. Six Sigma is all about making data-driven decisions in a scientific manner, but with this, the reliability of the data is extremely important. Finally, we need to understand what is the baseline for the current process. This is important for when we move further in the DMAKE process and have completed the project and we want to quantify the impact that it has had. Analyse is all about understanding the cause of the problem. This involves going to the process and seeing it yourself, taking measurements and finding the factors that influence the process. Do not jump to solutions here. This stage is just about finding the factors not devising the solutions. Specific tools like root cause analysis, FMEA or statistical tools can be used here to question the data and find insights into the root causes of the problem. The fourth step is about improvement. Having established what has caused the problem, improve involves brainstorming solutions and actually implementing them. It is important that solutions have permanent impact and aren't temporary countermeasures. That is why the analyse step is so important, because a thorough analysis will lead to a robust solution. The final control phase closes the feedback loop and ensures the results and impact are measured and controlled. This is really important as once an improvement has been made, we need to ensure the problem doesn't reoccur and the new improved way of working or process is being followed. That is a very quick overview of the DMAKE process and we'll go into further detail with real world example later in the course.